So, hey guys, in this video, I'll be talking about my setup, like uh, how I have installed VS Code and what editor I use, each and everything in a little detail so that you can also have a similar setup and start coding. So, let me share my screen and get started. So you'll be able to see my second screen now. Okay. So, guys, you can see I uh, just saw VS Code. So, you'll get this website code.visualcodestudio.com. Click on it. And based on your operating system, you need to install it. Okay, go to download phase and I think download has automatically opened for us. You can choose your operating system, but by default, I think they will detect your operating system and you can download it from there. It's as simple as that. So once you download it, okay, it will look something like this. So let me open VS Code. Maybe the color and feel can be different because I have changed it uh, according to my preference. So what will happen when you open it? It will be something like this, okay? So of course you may have some less number of these. These may not be present to you because I have added them. Okay. So of course these four will not be present to you anyway. So you need to go to this rectangular thing, which is called extensions. One, two, three, four, fifth from the top. Okay. So I have added a lot of extensions. I'll explain you those extensions and why I basically use them. Okay. This is dot interactive notebooks to get the feel of a notebooks. Okay, so you can basically get an idea how you have how to implement notebooks in JavaScript or any in a lot of language they have given an option. In case if you are not familiar with something, it's totally okay. You may not need it sometime. When we need it again, I'll tell you. So not a problem. If you if I tell you to install it, you uh, like if I tell you uh, like what do you say some extension, please install it. Please install it. Of course, of course, we'll see it after a while. What is the use of that? Okay. And uh, if I say something optional, it's totally optional for you to use it. Okay. Like dot note interactive notebook is totally optional in case if you are installing it. So it's like your IPython notebook. Okay. So you have to install Visual Code, of the, which is already there. After installing this, you have to also install dot net six SDK. Then only you'll be able to use it. Okay. In simple words, if they have a screenshots, I'll show it to you how it basically looks here. This is how it looks. Okay. So basically you can write a code like in your Python notebook that the way you write it, right? And so you write a piece in a small block, run it, and then the next block, like your collab in Google, okay? Same thing. Auto rename tag, this is useful tag to rename HTML elements, which I'll show you, please install it. Auto rename tag. So if you need to install it, just give it a search in, like auto rename, and you'll get a lot of options. Click here, June hand, okay? Click on install for you. It like for me, it's uninstalled. For you, it will be installed. Okay, in simple words. Okay, then I have Babel. As of now, it's optional, but you can install it in, in case if you're working for React and all that. This is a bracket pair colonizer, I guess, so that you can basically identify which bracket. Uh, like when you highlight a bracket, you basically understand it's starting and ending point. It's nice. CSS picks. Okay. Uh, you can install it. I'll explain you that. This is also based on React ES7 plus GitHub code space. You can neglect it for now. Copilot, I think you'll not have permission to use it, but you can install it and go to copilot.github.com and uh, apply for it. You will have a little waiting period. After that, it may get confirmed. You can do so. This basically gives you a lot of suggestions. Okay, so now this you can ignore as of now. Okay. This also you can ignore effort as of now. Indent rainbow is nice. So whenever you write a code, it appears like this. So basically you can understand, okay, this, uh, all the things in the same line, all the things in a different line, okay? So basically it helps you to have a proper indentation, okay? Jupyter Notebook, I think I install it for some purpose, but as of now, I don't use it. Please install Live Preview. I will show you how to use it. Live Preview and Live Server, okay? This is a very much needed thing, okay? You can see the uh, author Microsoft and they, 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 these are where the authors of this. Make sure you install of the correct author. Just give it a search and you'll get it. And you can also see the logo. So accordingly, you can install it. Okay. Live share I'm using, but as of now, you don't need it. So you can neglect it. Monokai Pro, I'm using this for the theme color. Okay. This is a theme which you can search it. Of course, it's free. Okay. Now, this is a prettier, of course, one of the best thing which helps you to format your code properly. Okay. There are some more things, but as of now, you don't need them. Okay. Right. So this is basically the simple setup that I have. Okay. And I'll be using VS Code always for all my codes and other things. Okay. So make sure you guys install it. If you want to have a setup exactly like me. In case if you want a different setup, it's totally up to you. But I recommend using VS Code. 
compared to any other editor. So that's all uh, guys for this video. It was just a quick video just to explain about my setup. That's all. See you guys. Bye-bye. So guys, I hope you've enjoyed my video, right? And as you know, these kind of videos, we are able to bring such quality content because of Newton School. Newton School is a, like a platform which helps you guys to perform a great career. Okay, to me, it will help you to build a great career in full stack development. Whether you are a working professional or a fresher, doesn't matter. Okay, they have different kind of batches for everyone. If you are a fresher, the best thing is you don't have to pay until you guys get placed with a package of 5 lakhs or more. If you are experienced, depending on your previous package, you guys, we can sit and decide your new packages, right? And then finally, once you get placed, and that's the time to rock. So they help you guys to build a great career, okay? So if you are interested in get, getting a great career in a tech background, do check out the link that is below this video. Okay, guys. So see you in the next video. Wait, guys. Where are you going? So fast? That's not good. Why? Because you have to do something small, small thing. And what are those? First, do like my uh, video if you really enjoyed it. Okay give it a thumbs up that's will be quite motivating for me okay subscribe to my channel and do turn on the bell notification like what will happen so you can get the future notifications of all my videos like i upload videos almost daily okay if you have any doubts or confusion don't forget to put a comment i'll try to answer your query as far as possible and you guys know sharing is power right sharing is knowledge as it has been rightly said so if you want both power and knowledge do share it with your friends Okay, and before you go, you can also check out this course on Launchpad. Uh, like on Launchpad, you'll get much more features like quiz and other things after every video. Okay. Okay, guys. So now I'll see you in the next videos. Bye-bye.